So we made a portal turret. Um, it currently tracks the color orange. When it sees something, it'll begin tracking it with the uh, color tracking camera right here. It'll fire LEDs, blink at you, say sounds, and it's all controlled over an Android app using Bluetooth. Pretty basic app, it's just some buttons that sends strings to the Bluetooth module. Bluetooth module reads that in over serial inputs and turret responds. It's in its entry mode. I see you. Target acquired. <laughs> So when it loses the signal, it, it reverts back to center. So we can try and find it again. And then when it loses it, it will see something else, like map on there. So it has a few, few different modes, like friendly, which will just say hello and goodbye. So it'll still follow it, but it won't fire because it's in friendly mode. Why? <laughs> it doesn't like to be alone. And then... Bye bye myself. And then also the effective turret mode. Who said that? So this is a mode where uh, something wrong with it. So the LEDs don't blink because it's not firing anything, and something's wrong with this voice modulator, so he can't actually say what he's supposed to. I got the bullets here? Anybody got bullets? So this is set up as one of its idle actions. So every minute it will say something like, will you come over here, or is anyone there? After five minutes, it will start to sing this. <laughs> so here we have all the guts of the thing. Um, we've got several LED arrays here on the sides to simulate the gunfire. We have an LED array around the eye that you guys saw that was uh, the ring. Um, we have an Arduino controlling the input from the camera. So this is the motion camera uh, right in here and it just specifically tracks colors and motion of colors. So we currently have it to track orange and uh, it'll just follow it wherever it goes. So we had to tap into the signal for that. Uh, and the Arduino's uh, tapping into that and sending that to um, the servo motors that pan left and right and up and down. Um, we have a couple pits controlling the LED arrays. The Arduino will send the signal to the pits because we needed them to light at the same time. We have a soundboard here. It has uh, built-in flash storage, so we just loaded some uh, songs, uh, MP3s, into the thing. Um, it plays off of different pins, and it's sent to a um, high-quality uh, amplifier that we built. So there's a little module in here, here the HC05. That'll just uh, pair and communicate with the phone. Um, it's sending a few keep alive signals, and, but mostly just command strings. Sends it serially over to the Arduino, and the Arduino just periodically checks if it's gotten a signal, and then we'll change its behavior based on that. <laughs>